Welcome back, everybody, to 70s and Alpha 21. I'm an old guy gaming, and this is the Apocalypse Ranger series. Uh, we had a successful Horde Night 14, if you didn't catch the last episode. And uh, now what we're going to do is we're going to set out and do opening trade routes and go find Trader Jin and start doing some more uh, arranging, because after all, we are a ranger. Uh, we have come across two ranger stations so far in the series and we have fixed both of those stations up and um the the first station that we fixed up was all the way in the extreme southeast corner of the map this is for anybody that hasn't been watching the series and then this is the second station we fixed up and it's currently our our base but um it's not necessarily at our permanent base it's just an outpost base but it's it's our kind of our main base at the moment uh, so what we're going to do now is we're going to start uncovering more of the map and do this opening trade routes, which is 3.7 clicks that way. And that is a Trader Gen. We're going to go see her, see what her stock is. Um, you know what? I don't remember, but it's possible that Wrecked, uh, uh, his stock flipped over today too. So let's just go check really quick because I, I don't remember what day it said that he was going to flip over. And then, uh, yeah, then we'll we'll go uncover Jen and, and start uncovering more of the map. And do a little bit of wandering, a little bit of ranging. That's the plan, Stan. So we'll go in here first. Uh, we, we did complete tier um, two with Rex, so we're actually on tier three with him now. But, um, again, I want to I get moving. We're not going to necessarily stay here. You're not bringing counterfeit money in At here, At least already. not. At least not right now. We might um, come back here and do some more tier threes for him later. We'll see. Uh, okay, let's take a look at your inventory. Nah, see, he doesn't restock until tomorrow. So, um, AP, that's a good one to have. Yeah, I think we'll wait. Yeah, I don't think he's got anything well, that, that we want. So, right you know what I could do, though? We could... To, oh man, all of his all of his stupid quests are are uh, tier threes. All right, never mind. I mean, not tier threes. I'm sorry, nighttime quests. I mean, I don't I don't mind doing nighttime quests, but I would have you know preferred a, a normal you know fetch and clear or something like that. But that's all right. Okay, let's get on the road here and uh, go say hi to Trader Jen and uh, see some more of the map here. We've pretty much been in the southeast corner of the map since we started this series. And so we, you know, once I get up a little beyond the uh, the top of the road there and around the bend, then this will be new territory for us. I still have two airdrops that I have not found yet either. So, I don't know, maybe someday those will become, um, we'll be able to find them. Or, you know, way down the, the road when we actually get a uh, gyrocopter we could fly back over the area and see if we can spot them that way too but i have just not been successful finding those things on foot so is what it is if we look at the map yeah see that so that's as far basically north um and west i suppose uh that i've been on foot looking for the airdrop Darlene, you just really want to get a knife in your head, don't you? All right, there you go. Ask and ye shall receive. Let's check this stump for honey. Hey, look at that. We got a honey. Fantastic. We'll take that. Don't care about the goldenrod. Okay, let's go. Here's a duffel bag. Nice. Look at that. We can now make fish tacos. It's a beautiful thing. Um, while we're kind of at the pinnacle of this hill, I just want to take a quick look out this way to see if we can spot any orange smoke. 
on either side here. Thing is, is this terrain in this immediate vicinity is so rugged that it could be, <coughs> you know, 50 yards away from us, but down in a gully and we'd never see it. Depending upon how high up in the air, I guess, the smoke goes, but... Chickens! Have I been this far? Yeah, this is about as far as I've been. Okay. I think I... Yeah, I went down that road on foot over to that uh, POI there. I didn't, I didn't loot it or anything. I might have grabbed some a couple things on the outside, but I didn't go in it. But I'd be kind of surprised if the airdrop was this far away anyway. Because we're quite a ways away from our base now. Let's check this um shopping cart. Yeah. Well, you know what? I'm gonna grab that because we we need it for hobo stew. We probably shouldn't go batshit crazy with looting though. He says as he stops to loot. <laughs> of course, we could find something good in this bag. Uh, well, yeah, right. Not that one. Uh, because we're kind of you know on a road trip. Oh, that looks like an army camp or something down there. We may have just found our next outpost, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, nope. Let's go check this place out over here. Yeah, it's definitely a camp of some sort. Ranger station or army camp or something. U.S. Fire Post 61. We got a honey nice so let's see this is a three skull so it's at the same level as we are at ourselves for our questing uh, or at least with wrecked um i guess the question then i have for myself is do i want to do this or do we want to move on to gin and come back here later. Oh, yeah, don't jump up into the to the barbed wire there, OG. I keep getting up on top and then jumping off. Okay. Um I think Oh. There's wasteland over there. Oh no, is Jin in the wasteland? Well, that's going to be fun. I, I I think we'll come back to here. Let's come back here, but I am going to mark it. Um, So we will call this... What is this called again? Um, U.S. Fire Post 61. Okay. So we will use, I guess, a tent... And we'll just call it Firepost 61. Okay. So this this will be another episode. Because um, we're going to need, you know, we're going to need to clear it. And then we're going to need to to clean it up. It doesn't look like it's in really bad shape from here, though. But we'll have to do some repairing. But I think I'd prefer to, to keep on keeping on. And let's get see if we can get to Trader Gen by the end of this episode. But, man, going through the wasteland, that's going to be interesting and it looks like we have to at least to go through it if not if she's not actually in the wasteland 
and I think I would, uh, well, we definitely want to stay on the road if we're going through the wasteland. We can't go across country on a bicycle. That's not going to work. Because, you know, we'd get caught on the all the crap that's in the terrain. And then a zombie bear would pop out of nowhere and I'd be lunch. Okay. Um, the good news, though, is if we do go into the wasteland, we're going to have a higher game stage as, or loot stage or whatever. Let's take a look at that really quick. So in the forest, we are at, man, we've already killed 823 zombies. So we're game stage 72. Wait, right? Is that what that said? Yeah, 72. Sorry. I'm tired. It's been a long day. I need to go to bed, but I want to get one episode recorded. So let's get all the way into the wasteland here. That bird might attack us. We're just slightly damaged. And I think he's going to leave us alone. And now we're 190. So we more than doubled our game stage, which means we really should loot... At least stuff, you know, cars and stuff that are close to the road. So that we can get pumpkin seed, because, you know, that's important. <laughs> Good grief. All right. Um, let's watch out for landmines. We'll check. We'll check this. Uh, or maybe what we should do is... Maybe we should just keep, keep on keeping on and get to Jin... Um, are you just normal? Yeah, you're just normal. And then we can, you know, depending upon how our time goes, we can loot on the way back. Alright, yeah, let's do that. Let's just keep moving because it's already uh, almost noon. And we will loot on the way back. So... Hmm. Let's look at the map here. She is that way. It almost looks like there's a little patch of forest that keeps going, but it probably, nah. Well, I don't know, is it? As long as the it stays forest and it doesn't get into that super rugged terrain. Of course, even if it did get into the rugged terrain, we could just put the bike in our backpack and walk. I don't know, man. Nah, I don't think so. I think the forest ends right here. Yeah, it most definitely does. Okay. Well, it was worth a try. So... Um, the absolute most dangerous threat in the wasteland is going to be the zombie bears. And then the second worst zombie is going to be the irradiated uh, ball sack dude. Because uh, I think if you get too close to him or if he spits at you, you, you actually start taking radiation damage here in Alpha 21. Oh, man. Cop car. I have lockpicks, right? I do. This could get us some ammo. Let's see if we can open this. I really hate the lock picking in this game. I don't hate lockpicking, uh, and Undead Legacy makes it an absolute joy because it does Fallout Skyrim-style lockpicking. That's it. We wasted eight fucking lockpicks on that car. Uh, I hate. There's two things I hate about it. I hate that it's 100% RNG. It doesn't take any skill whatsoever. And I hate that if it fails, then it pops all the way back up to five, even if you... Oh, shit. Let's go. Uh, even if you're at like point, a half a point, I, that makes zero sense. It's absolutely ridiculous. And so, yeah, that's why I hate it. And I'm just letting you know. Yeah, we gotta, <laughs> we gotta stay away from bears. That's what scares me more than anything. 
Okay. Let's go down this street here. At some point uh, in the future, we will definitely come into this town to do some looting and maybe even some questing. But we're not really in a position yet to be doing wasteland stuff. We're not there yet. We could try and break this car. Um, there's always a chance that a, the horde wouldn't come. I'm getting sidetracked, though. Yeah, you know what? Let's not screw around. Let's just go. Let's go see Jen. There's a dog right there, too. Uh, this looks like maybe a main highway out here. Yeah. Oh, hey, look, this is this is a different trader. Uh, nice. This is Bob, right? Yeah, we found Bob. Oh, fantastic. He's not even the trader we were supposed to go to, but I'm not complaining. Um, One of the things I like about Bob is he's got the most loot of all the traders. I, I'm pretty sure he does. Um, ex except for maybe Joel. I don't know if Joel has more loot than Bob or not. Okay, well, since we're here, let's just do a quick... Uh, loot, looting of his stuff, uh, and then we'll still move on uh, on to Jin just so we can, you know, finish that opening trade routes. But we now have Bob to also trade from, which is fantastic. Howdy, howdy! I'll come back and see you after I rob you. I mean, um, check all your stuff. Okay, let's go this way. gonna kind of grab everything for now and then we'll sort it out that uh, desk is not lootable some more corn got some red tea and some potatoes Lots of biker boots. Some books. Knife guy. Nice. Is there anything up here? Doesn't really look like it. Okay. Here's his workstations. No schematic in there, unfortunately. Okay, I think we checked all of that. Got some blue. Did we go in here already? I think, uh, no. We did not. Nice, another puffer coat. We already have one. Huh? I'd like to find a, a duster, but I think we actually can make a duster. I think we found the magazine for it. Forge. There we go. <coughs> nice. Now we can ma actually make lockpicks, finally. Okay, take that. Uh, I don't care about that actually anyways, and I don't think the traders ever buy those. So there's no point. Yeah, you stay there, bear. Um, that does have a sell price. Let's drink this. Okay, I think, I think that's it. All right. 
None of that's lootable. How goes it? It goes. I'm very happy to find you, my friend. Okay, let's take a look at his inventory. Ooh, he's got an impact driver, but look how expensive that sucker is. Okay, let's sell first. Is this... This is actually slightly better than what we're wearing. He doesn't... He doesn't want one of those. Okay. So we'll swap that out. I'm just going to sell this. All of that stuff we can... I'm not going to sell the glue. Okay. Thank you, Survivor. Check back soon. I get new merchandise daily. He'll probably buy the... That. I'm going to I'm going to toss a couple of these things just cuz we're on the road here. And they're just not that critical for us to be carrying around right at the moment. I I'll probably I'll try and keep the seeds. Um let's repair that. Okay. Now, let's go here and modify Modify and where? All right. You want to buy this? Safe oh, travel. Oh, did I just throw out the leather? Yeah, I did. <laughs> I want to see if you'll buy the leather. Okay, what do you have, man? You have a really cool impact driver, but that is way more money than I want to spend right now. Not to mention that I can't, uh, I can't afford it either. Okay. He's got Forge Ahead books. Be interested in those and maybe the Bow Hunter books. Oh, he's got a cement mixer. That's what we should buy, you guys. That way we don't gotta wait. Oh, this would be nice to have too for our knife, though. Um, Got a machete. He's got some good stuff. He's got a green tactical. He's got padded leg armor. And then I think that's the stuff that we sold to him. Okay, yeah. Um we're going to buy the we're going to buy the cement mixer. Yes, indeed we are. Okay, and we still have enough money left over to buy the tempered blade mod. Uh, it increases block damage and lowers degradation. I mean, yeah, why not? I'd, I'd prefer to have the serrated blade, but that'll that, that'll work. And that'd be kind of nice to have, but I don't think that's as high of a priority for us at the moment. And let's also buy these two magazines from him. Uh, since we have the cement mixer, I mean, we still need to, to eventually get to the chemistry station, too. So, yeah, let's buy those as well. And what? Uh, oh, no, we're out of money. Okay. You come back sometime. All right. So, look at that. We can now make a f uh, quality five wooden bow. And, oh, and, a, and an iron crossbow, but just a quality one. Okay. All right, that was, that was worth the price of admission. Um, finding that um, uh, cement mixer. So that is really, really good news. Okay, so where's that bear? Oh, he's right there. I wonder if we could cheese a bleed on him. the time that a little bit better I don't think can we hit through the because if, if we could kill this guy we could get a um... we could get a uh, testosterone for this uh, cigar I don't want to yeah it, it's just gonna take way too much ammo Problem is our bike's right there. <laughs> if I could time this. Man, 
man, that is really hard to time. Okay, well, shit. Um, I guess we probably need to try and... Pull them away from there. We're, we're pinned in a little bit here. Come on, bear. Did you have to be right by my bike? Can you guys come down here? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, well, I guess... I guess I'm going to have to go over here and hunker down and wait for them to wander off. <whistles> Trying to get where it's a little darker so our stealth meter goes down a little more. I don't know if that actually matters, but... All right, I'm just going to wait here until they calm down and, and wander off because there's no way I'm going to try and go out there and jump on the bike with that bear right there. And go. Go, 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 go. Okay, we got away. Whew. <clears throat> it wasn't the, the best thing in the world to leave. Bob's gate open, but we kind of had to just get the hell out of there quick. Let's see if we can make the trader gin here without getting killed. Got a dog while we're going up the hill. Let's make sure we have full stamina. I'm not sure if we'll be able to outrun him. We'll clear everywhere else. You know what? We might be able to bypass him now. Let's just go. There's another bear there. Shit. Um, we can distract bears with rocks. I don't want him to go down on the lower road where we gotta go. There's another bear there too. Dudes are all over the place, man. Alright, let's go. Oh, he's still on the road. Let's just give him a wide berth. Oh, look, there's a desert. Okay, cool. Oh, shit, there's another bear. Damn it, Jim. Okay. No... I don't this place is dangerous as all get out let's uh see if we can just get through it okay that wasn't too bad good so it looks like Jenny's in the desert that's very good to know I'll take the desert over the wasteland anytime except for the fact that the wasteland's got better loot, but that's the only good thing about it. Um, by the way, for those of you who may not know, uh, this map, the Yodi, the the wasteland and the deserts in the center of this map, and then the northern, oh, I'd say northern third of it is snow and then the rest of it's all forest she's still 1.2 clicks that way uh, I don't know if I want to get off the highway only because it looks like that's pretty rugged terrain I suppose we could hike it on foot if we had to Though, 
But let's let's just stay on the road for the moment. And you know, if it doesn't start turning towards the north fairly soon, then we might try going across country. Thank you.